I request you to say a few words. Light, 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 his own, as I keep telling my students to do that. He practices it. He's like water that takes on any color, and all colors are part. He's an actor's actor. One of the finest that we have ever had in this country. Let's see with Shah. to me that it's been 48 years that sir has been teaching students like me like you 1963 was the date I saw I was busy failing in class 9 at that time <laughs> and uh, sir was beginning his teaching journey 48 years I have done a little bit of teaching too uh, at both my alma maters the Film Institute and the National School of Drama. And I normally don't last more than a week. I know how utterly exhausting this business can be because there isn't textbooks you can ask the students to refer to. There's no formula that they can mug up and come tomorrow so they get 10 upon 10. It's helping them delve into themselves. It's dealing with human beings that is the job of a teacher, to help the student find their own potential. There's a very old saying that acting can't be taught, but it can be learnt. Sounds like a paradox, but it's very true. And Sir was the first person in my life I met who helped me learn. There were others who commanded you to learn. There were others who felt it, who reminded you of your duty and so on your responsibilities, your future. But Sir was intent only on letting you find yourself. And he was there to show you the way like a torchlight every time there was dark, which, of which there was plenty, I may tell you, uh, in those days when we were students. And Shelly Singh is, of course, much senior and was at the Institute much before my time. Harish and I were there together, but he was a year ahead of me. So they can testify to those days, and the only light at the end of the tunnel was the things that we could learn. And here was this person who was, uh, who managed to keep his sanity despite generation after generation <coughs> idolizing him and, and practically worshiping him. It's very, very difficult to keep your feet on the ground when everybody around you is telling you that you're God. You know, you, you, you sort of tend to start believing it. And I've seen it happen to, to, to person after person. I've seen it happen to people who started their career after mine. And uh, Sir's ability not only to be gentle and persuasive at the same time, but to also involve himself to the right degree with your personal life. Never ever was there any interference, never ever was there any lecturing us on morals. He always let us find our own. And when I joined the drama school, which was in 1973, and the uh, course was about to face closure, there were machinations going on to close the course down. And uh, the year after that, sir, left uh, the institute. And I cannot tell you what a void uh, there was after he left. And that void still exists, despite the fact that the acting course has been reopened. But it's, it's a black hole because there is nobody there to give you any guidance or any light.